So in the following video, video we will see how easy it is to replace the screen, the laptop screen on Lenovo uh, ThinkPad T540P. Well, all that you need is the laptop, uh, the cross screwdriver and regular one, just in case. And also you'll need a replacement screen, which I just got uh, by email. So the first step is, as you can see on my laptop, uh, the problem was with, uh, with some lines on the screen here, in this right part. So first I'll turn off the laptop. Okay, it's fully off. I'll remove the battery. Let's move it aside. Uh, the next thing we will remove this uh, the bezel around the screen. What you can do just put your fingers behind in the inner side and pull out gently. You can also use certain uh, like cardboards for the outer side, but uh, just pull gently. It will go off very easily. Okay, so the frame went easily off. Uh, okay. The next thing is we have to remove the the old screen. All you have to do is just use the screw, uh, the cross screwdriver, and remove all the four uh, screws that are holding the old screen. There, in one is here, and then the second. And the last one. So those were the screwdrivers. Then you just gently uh, put your two nails behind the the old LCD, and it will go off very nicely. Uh, okay, now the old screen is was uh, was unscrewed. Now you have to detach it from the connector. The connector is here, so you'll have to peel off the, this uh, tape very gently from, you know, from the right side. Just do it really, really gently. It will go nicely. Easily. Okay, the tape is off. Now you also have to remove the... There is one wire that is holding the, the connector to the LCD screen. Use these, the, the thin screwdriver, and pop it off from the side. Here, easily. Okay. And the old screen was detached from the side. Now we have to put in the, the new LCD screen. Okay, I'll leave this on. Here. Um, as you can see, there is a tape, and then you have this little wire coming off. Try to attach it, try to attach the connector first, and then put the wire back on the place and re reattach the tape. Uh, you can use the screwdriver, but be, be careful with the connector. Okay, it's on place. Now you have to pop in the wire. Okay, it's also in the place and attach the tape once again. You can also use some extra extra tape to put over it, but I don't have any at the time. So I'll just leave it like that. Okay, so the screen is now attached. Let's put it on place and see if it works. So, um, too far. Okay, cool. The screen is on place. Let's see if it works. Oh, uh, yeah. I need to have to plug in the the battery. Well, I'll screw it uh, fully and attach the battery and test if it works.
And the last one. Cool. So the screen is attached. Let's place in, let's put in the battery and see if it works. screen works perfectly. Let's turn it off. Uh, the next thing is we have to remove the, the shield, uh, the additional foil, uh, which is, which was, which was put, uh, over the screen. Just peel it off gently. Oh, it's like brand new. Okay. And let's put on the, the final frame, which was removed in the beginning. Just put it on and snap it on place. Okay, for this uh, bottom part, put the hand on the back side and press gently. Cool, the screen is back in place. Let's see if it works once again. Yeah, it's like brand new. That was all.